Okay, so the last thing I do want to show is the before and after of all the small little pieces that make up this image. I mean, it looks like we've got about 10, 12, maybe a few more layers here. Um, so I'm going to hide them all to start, and we'll go through one by one and show where we started. So here's how we started. This is actually after a little bit of Lightroom, so it's not even the, you know, the raw photo, but close to. Um, and I'm going to zoom in to 1% or 100% here. And one for one, there's our blemishes. Okay, we got rid of some of those. Um, here is our eyes. And there's our soft light that kind of shaped our face. So I'm going to zoom back out. There's before and after. And here uh, we, we adjusted the lips just a little bit. Not a lot, just a little. Um, and then here we added some skin softening. That was kind of a nice little softening. And then we added sharpness back to the skin so that it still looked like skin and not plastic. Um, and then after that, let's see here. This was the silver effects. That really added some punch and contrast to our image. Let's zoom all the way out. There's the silver effects right there. Pretty cool. I like what it does to the background too. And there is uh, a level adjustment. I think we were actually in the levels, but color adjustment. It got a little red after that uh, silver effects. A little red and orange, so we toned that down a bit. And then here we softened the hair with the same softening that we did for the skin. So there's a little bit softer hair. And then we added dodge and burn to the hair to give it some more sheen, shine, and also to the dress. To make the dress pop just a little bit more so there's the dress pop pop and lock in and then our last curves adjustment layer so here is the before and the after before and after thanks again my name's Nikian and if you have any questions feel free to contact me at www.photos at dot com.